Yo, what's up guys? It's Ryan and we're here uh, gonna start a new track and this one's gonna be super super music theory based and yeah it's gonna be super jazzy is all I know <laughs> at this point in time so let's uh let's get right into it I'm gonna go with G minor just because So, G minor, add four right there, and then walk it off to the A. to the four right there Add in. And that, that one can hold for a while. Then that'll go to the three. Up to the four again. Uh, better timing. Right there, could go to the the dominant, which I have right there, I think. Yeah. Shorten that, and then make it F A C, and then E flat. All right, and then that's. Okay, so just quick recap in case you're wondering what chords these are. Um, so in G minor, it's the one add four to the. Um, this would technically be an inverted five add six with a little passing thing to the yeah the, the four add nine I'm gonna actually go ahead and add a seven so four major four major nine uh, I'm gonna add this note here too to a passing tone which is just this chord up a half step uh, to the five add nine <laughs> to the three add nine to the four add nine or four major nine because I added that note in there again to the five seven yeah yeah 
<laughs> so <clears throat> that's that's that. Uh, definitely not complicated. <laughs> but I'm gonna start adding in little. called scat and it's essentially going to be pretty random notes Never mind. I'll get to that later. I'm gonna I'm gonna just build a bit of a song around it first. Uh, so ultra jazzy G minor tempo 100 saved. Okay, now now I'm gonna get some drums in, and I'm not gonna use superior just because it's the wrong style. Hip hop. Hip hop is probably the best, like, or closest genre to whatever this is going to end up being. And that can be our snare, or a kick for now. Snare. Something like that. Um, so the snare is for sure going to be on like that, so. Um, feels super generic for now. That's okay. Need a kick on all of these like offbeat. Whoops. So basically just a kick every time a chord hits. And then whenever it just needs it. So something like that. I like that roads better. get to processing once I actually build like a kit around it. Hi hat. Vintage. Or not. Oh. I'll just make a pretty straight hi hat pattern all right 
and then I'm going to go ahead and set up the ghost kick like this. Just before things get too too crazy. All right. Um, side chain. Make it black. Like that. Go ahead and group the percussion. And go ahead and organize it all, you know. All right, and then I can add some like ghost snares. That first one's unnecessary. gonna make a different channel for those just to have them separated Um, so next I need like a base. Uh, I'm going to make a separate group for bases just because that's usually a good idea. All right, so drag this down. Come on. Uh, right color. All right. And then just grab like a massive or something. Uh, new sound, sign square. Yeah, all right, yeah, that's nice sounding. Um, something I wanted to look into those potentially adding more notes into these right here. Maybe like an add eleven. have this I just add a th another three Last note. It's being 
A. Um, let's do some processing. Let's take out the lows. chain to the ghost. compress this just a little bit. And the sub, I'm going to compress as well. So that's cool. Um, a little verb to the. Or I, I should set up the reverb channel the way I like it. Like that. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna give the hi hat some. Some reverb. I also need to EQ the lows out of it. Alright, big kick. Sweet. Um, <clears throat> so, next thing I want to add is just a texture thing. Uh, so, Black Octopus. I think it's under Atmospheres. Yeah, Dust and Dirt. Use these all the time. gives it a little bit of texture in the top, you know? The one you 
would be crazy though one though. So I'm kind of feeling like a, a bell sound, um, but pretty like chilled out. So probably like a marimba. So let's go ahead and grab one of those from Goliath. It's probably gonna be loud. Maybe an octavire. notes and the chords. All right, maybe some delay to like, fill everything out. a bit loud. Okay, so that's a pretty good start. I I like to think to this. Um like a lead line I think let's hope this doesn't suck okay so
something like that. That's pretty good for like placeholder. So for now, that's a pretty good placeholder. Um, but I'm gonna call this a video, just cause 30 minutes, you know, that's kinda the standard I've set. Um, so yeah, if you've got any questions about any of this, uh, be sure to let me know. I know there's a whole, not a whole ton of in production, it's more songwriting, music theory, and this one. But I was just really like feeling the, the genre. And I've been playing this sort of stuff on guitar a lot recently, so figured I'd make a track out of it. Um, but yeah, any questions, let me know. I'd be more than happy to answer them. And uh, like, comment, subscribe, do all that. And I'll see you in the next video, probably tomorrow, where I continue to work on this track. All right, thanks for watching, and bye.